All right. I wanted to show you a little new toy that I got for shooting the bow races. We are going to do something totally different. I always want to edit a second camera and even a third camera. But uh, what I got the other day is going to be for the second camera, or I might use it for a live feed behind the third barrel. I haven't decided yet. But what I'm doing this time around, we're going across the country. I'm not going to take my camera with me. I just don't feel like lugging the camera through the airport and all that fun stuff. So that is Decepticon behind me. Tearing up my new chair. So this is the new toy. This is called the Platy Pod. Platy Pod Max. It's a simple plate with a ball head on it. I gotta remember to keep my hang on. Simple plate with a ball head on it. And this would probably take somebody that welds like five minutes to make. And it's like the simplest thing in the history of the world. Add the camera ball head to it. And Grab a camera. Oh, you can see I'm totally prepared. So now my camera goes on there. Like this. And it will hold perfectly level. It Instead of using the tripod, having the tripod legs extended and all of that stuff, this just goes right down. And I can put it on a fence post. Or I can, it's got little holes that I can strap it right into uh I can bungee cord it into a fence post or something like that. And it's got little legs that go up. So if I want to put it off balance on a rock, uh, this is going to be excellent for the car shows because I can put it on the ground and point it up. That is Dancer behind, uh, Meepo behind me. Except to kind of move to my lap. I'm having lots of cat problems today. So, yeah, so that's the setup. I'll still have the tripod and all that stuff set up, but this will be for my second camera. But when I'm taking the camera, on the road. Debbie's taking hugs, but I'm not going to take mine because I don't feel like lugging. So what we're going to do is I'm going to add this to the platypod. I can't wait to make a homemade version, let's tell you the truth, because I would make it so much different. We add this. Oh, it's going here. There we go. Just didn't want to go in. So we add this to this, and if you've seen me do the live feed, you probably know what's coming next. And it is going to be the iPad. Right there. Right now I have the iPad on it. So I can put this iPad on the ground, pointing up behind the railing, and do live feeds from there. Or I can do car shows and have it tilt back and all sorts of stuff. But what I'm going to do is this time around it's going to be totally iPhone shot. And I'm going to use the camera and the iPad because the new iPad Pro that I have is like absolutely crazy when it comes to uh, photos. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to use the iPad photo and the Platypod. And I can even hold this as if it's a regular camera. So it's nice. I should take a picture of. There we go. First picture taken with the Platypod is a picture of. You're taking a picture with the platypod. And as you can see, it's perfect resolution and stuff. So, yeah, so that's what we're going to be doing. I'm going to be using my iPad as my camera for this trip. I don't plan on taking a lot of pictures. So, that's it. Hope you enjoyed this little uh, Tech Talk Tuesday. There you go. Maybe I should do this every Tuesday. That sounds like fun. All right, enjoy.